this tutorial we will learn about functions a function is a built-in predefined formula in excel one of the key benefits of function is that the, they save your time since you do not have to write the formula yourself for example you could use an excel function called sum to quickly add mathematical digits <laughs> or numbers excel has hundreds of different function to assist with your calculation each function has a particular syntax which must be strictly followed for the function to work correctly the function library is a large group of functions on the formula tab you can see function library uh, these function library include auto sum descent used financial let me explain these things okay so auto sum auto sum easily calculates the sum of a range and recently used it means all recently used functions Com uh, commands or formula you can see here okay and uh, financial means uh, acquired interest cash flow return rates and additional financial functions you can find out here in the logical you can find out if not or true etc and text it is a text based functions okay and this is time and date function you can uh, functions calculated on time and date and this is math and trigonometry i think mathemat this these are mathematical function you can find out here more functions like statical engineering cube information and etc now let's insert a function okay so to insert a function click the cell where you want the function applied okay before doing this let me give you an simple example like uh, four and uh, five okay so click the cell where you want the function applied or where you want to see your result okay then go to formula tab formulas tab then click on insert function the insert function dialog box opens now choose the function from the dialog box you may search uh, on a particular function in the dialog box or change the category and select the function like uh, I'm going to select recent most recent used okay then select your formula like i'm going to select some then click ok here you can see function argument dialog box opens now select the range or range of cells for function argument and like i'm going to select 
a4 then the second number is sorry it is a1 and it's b3 then click ok and you will see the fun sum function is used to add numbers so here we have added these two number four and five you can see the formula here which is used by a library function of a sorry functional library similarly like uh, one more example i want to use a sum function once again so uh, this time i will select blank cells okay so sum okay and i'm going to select d6 remember these things okay d6 i'm selecting d6 and as a second number i'm selecting e7 and uh, as a third number i am going to select uh, d8 and then click ok you can see here we have our formula equal sum d6 d7 e or d8 okay so now we are going to write here some number and see what will happen first uh, d6 so here is d6 now i'm going to write here 12 then select uh, e here you can say, see that it is changing automatically 4 and 4 so you can see that how you can use these functions for adding or calculating average or multiplication or division or some financial uh, calculation or uh, here more function engineering or static color cube or information whatever you want you can use this function for your own purpose thanks for watching this video